Some Can I like sorry Tim? Go on, John. I'm like two things back just came to my mind. <laughs> Speaking, I'm thinking of this backup. Okay, so as Dr. Skinker said, someone going to know, well, this is the copper line, so I can call the police. I mean, are we going to know what phone is what? A lot of no, those are our copper lines in. are like our uh, our elevator, emerge, the phone that sits in the elevator when the elevator gets stuck, our alarm system, some of those things. Uh, we have a couple of general main office lines that are on both copper and fiber, so like she's saying, it would if one fails, so you'll just, know, but it you'll just know. kicks in. Yeah. Okay, it'll kick an auto. There's a switch. Yeah. Okay, just well, hold on. It's a not like the bad. So are we shrinking that? <laughs> <going? laughs> we have a lot of hot flies. That's all right. I'd it's like to hear the answer not from yeah. somebody on the board who lacks, might lack the complete knowledge. <laughs> Some people. Well, well, I don't know what they do, and this, the I systems know, are different in different buildings. So, does no, somebody okay. know what happens? Which phones are? On, why don't we do this? Because it was a little unclear. Which phones are on fiber, which are on copper, and which will run on both if they need to switch? Okay. Um, currently, everything's on copper. Okay. With it. Um, our main, as they call it, our DID trunk, which is all our direct lines and Wait, everything. Please. Too much information, I understand. But our main first phone service lines will all be over copper. Um, I mean, over fiber, I'm sorry. Our POTS lines, the alarms, the... Um, whatever uh, is all with what it is um, will stay copper, but there would be a switch that if the main line goes down, we can use the copper lines. We get notification that it's down, and we would be able to do the 911. So it doesn't go automatically. You have to be notified and get some you, kind of you, switch. You will get a notification that you're down from Comcast. So what? <laughs> or if you pick up a dot, I'm sorry, Tim. If you no, pick up I, dial tone, it ain't there. You. It flip it. It should. It should, in theory, switch to the copper to be able to make outgoing calls. So anything that's on fiber optics will switch to copper. If, the if fiber it's down, goes we'll be down. able to make calls out. And then, yeah. if the and copper calls. goes down, will that switch to fiber then, optics? Well, they're all on fiber. No. What would happen? If the fiber goes down and the copper goes down, then we're completely down. Well, it, it didn't ask. That, I know, but that, we could that was out. what it is. If there's so no the power, then would the be is, If the fiber's out, it would be fixed within a four-hour window by Comcast. Okay. That's yeah, nice. So then now it would switch back this. from copper back to fiber. Scott, they want to just make sure that there's people in the building know we, we which are notified. phones, which, no, hold on. They just want to make sure that there's people within the building We'll know which lines can dial out when the fiber is down. We we will be able to do that. Okay. How? So so if, if there was an emergency and someone picks up their phone, does it automatically switch to copper if the fiber should be out? Yes, this may be a one in a thousand chance. That's what this board is asking right now. It's just to make sure that we have a plan in place so that if fiber goes out, which phones, or if all the phones are on copper? If you don't know that answer, you can report this back in April. Okay. Well, why don't you? Because I didn't, that, I didn't understand that at all. So okay. why don't you tell us what phony, what, what's running through the copper, what's running through the fiber optics, and which would switch? If the fiber goes down, what switch the copper? If the copper goes so, down, what switches the fiber? So Scott, the power goes out, the fiber would still work. It should. You're right. Because it's not driven by. It's not driven by. It's not a, a void system. It's not a power-driven system. So, mm -hmm. and the fiber comes in underground. It it will be a separate line coming in from a different um, point from where our current fiber is, the primary. So, yes. Because you know, because yeah, right now different. the copper goes out because right. the tree falls around and the copper goes mm -hmm. out, right? Right. That's like it how be the, it, that's how your phone goes out. It could potentially be the same thing with fiber. Right. If a tree, you know, if some, someone drives through and hits where the line comes in, you know, the internet could be down. But yeah. same thing could happen when you have the additional line with the fiber. With Comcast, if something happens to it, it would be down. So the point of entry is still the same. It would be different points of entry. Different points of entry, which is what I think we're looking at. Because you're going to your MPO from a different spot. It's two different locations. Right. So if the tree falls on this side of the building, the fiber zone, it falls on that side of the building, the copper's going, basically, in a nutshell, kind of. It's a first read. 
that right, I, right to question down. We can report I on it. In April. I will. I will find out exactly. Dr. Dean just asked you tonight. Asking. He didn't submit it ahead of time. He knows he's got to wait now to get an answer till the next meeting. It's okay. So you're okay. We'll I'm just thinking ahead. <laughs> One in a thousand. <laughs> I understand. Plus, you, that's why you sold the second uh, to the second option there. So, I'm just following up on that. So we'll, we'll get it. But, but the number of it's pot not lines, lines. the it's number of the, same the number of pot three. lines. Just so the board is aware, originally we had over thirty. They're down to seven now. So we were being um, overcharged for those additional well, lines that we didn't know. What do those cost a piece? It's roughly, with taxes and everything, about 50 to $55 a POTS line. So we're saving approximately 1000 a month? Yes. <laughs> okay. So it, it, the, bill, the bill and all the service was looked at thoroughly to figure out exactly what the district truly needs. Right. So That's what I'd like to hear. So, so my point is the savings here, this yes. Comcast fiber over the call one, is that the current rate or was that the previous what we paid the last year right? no that's, that's after problem. after reducing all the service and getting down to what is truly needed that's what our current monthly rate is with call one so if we were to say it uh, based on last year we actually this is a greater savings than you're showing that would be exactly true because it doesn't account just the proposal doesn't account for the elimination of all the pots lines. right which is what the consultant helped us do in the first place correct mm -hmm. the consultant really paid for himself Yes, right. sir. Absolutely. Anybody else? Any more questions, John? Before we move? <laughs> That's it. Thanks. So, Scott, just make sure we figure you could explain to the board when they approve it next month how the copper will turn on when the fiber is not working so that people can call out in the event of an emergency. Yep. Okay, then let's move on to the uh, closed session resolution. I got it right in front of me. Resolved that the Board of Education Township High School District 208 Cook County, Illinois enters closed session for the purpose of considering appointment, employment, compensation, discipline, performance, or dismissal of specific employees of the public body or legal counsel for the public body, student discipline, purchase or lease of real property, probable, imminent, or pending litigation, collective negotiations, and school safety. Is there a second? A second. second. Uh, uh, Mr. Smith, sorry. Uh, Dr. King? Yes. Ms. Sierra? Yes. Mr. Smith? Yes. 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 Can we start five minutes at 10 after the closed session? 